During normal labor, as the cranium makes contact with the cervix, the cervix dilates. However, in certain presentations, for example the one in the diagram, facial presentation, the process is slowed down due to the poor congruity between the face and the cervix. Presentation is defined as the part of the cranium which enters the maternal pelvis first. In the case of facial presentation, it is the chin and the eyes which are the presenting part, as the head is in hyperextension. Unlike the cranium, the face is not designed to resist the forces of delivery, and therefore this often results in a difficult birth. Furthermore, the bones of the face are unable to mould to overlap in the same way that the bones of the cranium are able to overlap. These two factors result in labour being delayed and often result in a caesarean section being carried out. It is understandable that a lot of stress and strain is put through the face during this kind of labour and often results in interosseous strains. You can see from the diagram the head is in hyperextension and there is extreme stretch being put through the anterior structures of the neck as well as compression through the occipitoatlantal joints. All of these factors need to be taken into account when assessing a child.